What's up? I'm Little Lotus. What's up? I'm Smart Death. This and is uh, Tour Prank Slash Games, baby. You know what the fuck it is. Odds is a good best, game. Best game, honestly. If you don't want to do something and someone's going to make you do it, this is the best game ever. Uh, so basically, you count down from 3 to 1 based off a 1 to 10 scale. 1 so, to 100, though. 1 to 100. Gentleman it, rules uh, is 1 to 10. Yeah, yeah. You choose the number. We're explaining this terrible. So basically someone... We have to show them. Uh, you would the, ask, you would ask someone odds, a question. You run out of traffic. Uh, one in ten. One in ten. Alright, three, two, two one, four. seven. Uh, but if we both said the same number, I would have to run, run out, out of traffic, traffic right now. Or if I didn't want to run out in traffic, I have to take a slap. That's and what taking a slap, that. you gotta pull up your shirt show them the, and you slap them on the belly. You can still see one. this residue from the slap residue. I took. Because, uh, but this was like a week and a half ago. Yeah. And I lost in odds to Jesse that I would have to buy him Gucci slides. And I was not gonna buy that full Gucci slides. <laughs> he doesn't deserve them. And so I took the slap, he slapped me hella hard. Um, I did get Gucci. Uh, get, I did get Jesse really good though. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah. We did uh, odds out of what sixty or a hundred mm. that yeah, he good. would neti pot a Smirnoff Ice, and he we landed on the same number and he lost. So <laughs> and he did it. We went to the bathroom and uh, just neti potted a Smirnoff Ice in his nose. Pretty great. A prank that's been going on. It started on the last tour I was on between me and this photographer Copes. Fuck you, Copes. Uh, we were just icing each other. Um, so at first we were like really sneaky, like I would hide it in his camera bag, he would hide it. I'm not sure how, he wasn't that sneaky, I was sneakier. But then eventually we started just icing each other because we were bored. Um, cause we would have like long ass drives and shit. But then, it has carried over to now, he's sending people to shows to ice me. And they're somehow smuggling in Smirnoff Ices, doing a terrible job at being sneaky, but I'm a good sport. So I was pissed off about that, so I've been sending people to his home in Connecticut to ice him, and uh, it's just ongoing. He's coming here tonight. Fuck you, Copes. And I I'm gonna put a ice him. In yours, the He's, first one. You did? Oh, oh yeah, I you did. You. He danced with me. I, I thought to, we were being friends. I, I had grabbed him and I was like, "Hey, like, dance with me." <laughs> For no reason during a song. And I thought we were he was cute. dancing with me and we were hugging each other, holding each other, and then behind his back. Uh, a hot leather ran over with a with the fucking smeared off ice and put it in his bag. And this, and oh no! But this kid like, came. That was me. no. This kid came with shorts and he was like, "Can you sign these shorts?" And I was like, so, saw how he's holding the shorts. I was like, "There's an ice in there." And he was like, "Oh shit!" I was like, "Whatever, I'll do it." Um, but yeah, fuck you, Copes.